Hi, my name is Eric Jones from InThought, and I'll be demonstrating today how to use fancy indexing to select values out of a NumPy array. We'll do this in an IPython-PyLab environment, which sets up a numerical environment for us. It's available in the InThought Python distribution. We'll just uh, create an array here with the linspace function with 51 points in it from 0 to 2 pi. So if we look at this, x goes from 0 up to 6.28, which is 2 pi. Then I'm going to make it a y array here that's just cosine of x. Now if I plot these versus each other, I'll set the line width equal to 3 here so that we'll get a little bit bigger plot. So here's our plot uh, of the cosine array. Imagine I want to overlay some dots on top of the values where y is greater than zero. So these values and these values, but not these down here. Well, one of the ways you can do that is look for the values where y is greater than 0 and point zero. That will give you a mask. And you'll notice there it's true at the beginning uh, for these values, false in the middle down here, and true when we get to the top of the array. You can also use that uh, mask, I'll just assign it to something called mask, you can name it whatever you like. You can use that to index into an array. So I'll use y, um, uh, using this mask, we call this fancy indexing, and it just selects out the values where uh, this mask was true. So you'll notice that y is full of values that uh, are both positive and negative, but we've only selected out the values here where y was positive. All right, so if I come in and say plot versus y, uh, oh, I want to do it with a mask. So we'll just select out the values that match the mask. And then I'm going to um, uh, use uh, a format where we're going to plot red uh, circles. And then I'm going to set the marker size here equal to 10. And we get these big dots displayed here. Uh, and you'll notice it's only for values greater than zero. Now you might want to go one step further and select not just from uh, based on a criterion for y here where y was greater than zero but also where say x was greater than pi. So we would just select the values up here. How can you do that? Well let's make a mask. Uh, we'll call this mass 2 and we'll say y greater than zero. That was our first uh, condition and x greater than pi. And now if we look at mass 2, you'll notice it's false in the beginning and true at the end. And so I'll just come back up and use that to select out those values. But this time instead of red, we'll use, uh, say, uh, uh, green to mark those dots. And you'll notice that now these dots are green, these dots are red. So that gives you an idea of how to use fancy indexing to select values out of NumPy arrays. Thanks for watching.